Hello YouTubers, this is Tim at JL Miniatures. Just wanted to give you guys a quick update and another uh, video. Right now you're looking at the Glotkin. Uh, this miniature is absolutely huge. And when I say huge, I mean huge. This right here is uh, Gut Rot, to give you an idea. He's on the 40 millimeter base. I just did a video on him showing, uh, showing his uh, painting off and stuff like that. Uh, with the Glotkin, I am at uh, probably around six hours right now. I'm going to take and get right into him. Um, I've got his face pretty much where I want it, his head, uh, the horns and stuff like that. I'm still working on, uh, they have a lot of uh, pustules on the inside and stuff like that. The horns uh, have been uh, painted and stained. I've got this open top right here I've got to take and work on. Uh, this is where one of his brothers stands. This is where the other brother will stand. These three holes here hold a torch and some type of Nurgle uh, sign and I think a spike or something like that. Here's the belly that I'm still working on here. There we go. Uh, the scars up there on the top with the Nurgle, I'll be painting those a fleshy color with a like a pink. Same thing with the uh, the purple guts hanging out. I still got to take and finish those up along with his uh, his toenails. I've got the um, the nails uh, pretty much finished up, stuff like that. All these, as you can see, going all the way up his arm uh, are going to be like a reddish, orange, yellow, pale, uh, off yellow looking by the time I'm done. The uh, Mark of Nurgle here, hold on, sorry about that. Get this thing focusing a little bit. Um, with the three skulls, I'm going to take and trace that out in a red. And then he's got all the rest of the little broken skin uh, areas that I've got to take and uh, put in uh, like a red or something like that. Uh, his back right there, you can see that I've really, I've worked really hard on trying to blend the colors because I wanted a really nasty, um, I went from like dark greens to medium greens to light greens to an off yellow white to um, a light brown I, I wanted to give it kind of like a really bad skin um, bed sore typish look and then as you can see all the the rest of the pustules and all that the rotted skin I've still got to go through and do that I've got another couple hours on it and then I should be pretty much uh, finished up with it so I'm hoping I was gonna my first challenge to myself was doing all the painting for this guy in four to five hours. Well, after putting them together, it took me probably about an hour or so to put them together. Uh, I realized he's got so much detail to do four to five hour paint job on him would be uh, a real tragedy. So I've decided I'm going to give myself 12 hours. So we'll see how that all goes. Um, this is uh, setting two. So that's. Uh, that's where I'm at right now so hopefully uh, by this next setting I'll at least have half of what I want done and then one more setting and I should be completely finished uh, again this is Tim at JL Miniatures if you are interested in doing a consignment or anything like that please get a hold of me uh, just message me I will get back with you if you have any conversion needs or anything like that uh, please get a hold of me thank you have a great day